All right, so welcome to IELTS Life Skills A1 Speaking Test. My name is Arifur Rahman Shamim. I will be the examiner today. I have two candidates with me today. On my right side, candidate A, and on my left side, she will be candidate B. So let me first introduce with candidate A. Candidate A, what is your full name? My full name is Papia Sharkar. You can call me by my first name, Papia. Okay, can I see your identification? There is my passport which I will use for my registration. Take care. Okay, spell your name. Uh, my name is Papia Sharkar. Uh, my first name is Papia uh, P A P I A and my surname is Sharkar H A R K A R. Okay, yeah, you can keep it here. Now I will introduce you with candidate B. What is your full name? Okay, can I see your identification? Okay, can you spell your name? Yes, my first name is Dalita, P A L I T H A, middle name is Irena, E W L E N A, and surname is Liz, L E A I. So, how can I call you? You can call me Dalita. Dalita, alright. So, this Life Skills A1 speaking test will be conducted in three parts. In part one, we will we'll be asking some general questions, just introducing with each other. And in part two, <clears throat> you will have the chance to ask questions to each other, okay? And in the part three, you will have a dialogue, together you will make it. So let's begin with candidate A. Okay, candidate A, what do you do in your free time? I'm doing many things uh, like gardening, reading book, and cooking. I love cooking, so most of the time I uh, uh, cook, uh, cook um, many dessert and uh, many dishes in my free time. Okay, so do you sometimes go watching movies? Uh, yes, sometimes I go with my friends and sometimes I go with my parents uh, watching movie. It's uh, happened um, uh, uh, twice a month. Twice a month. Yes. Okay. So, what kind of movies do you normally watch? I watch science fiction movie. I love science fiction movie. Okay. Who is your favorite artist in the movie? Um, my favorite artist is uh, Bollywood uh, actress uh, Shahrukh Khan. Okay, Shahrukh Khan. Which movie Shahrukh Khan performed last? Uh, it's, uh, it was Pathan. Pathan, okay. So where did you watch this movie? Did you watch it in Bangladesh or outside? Where did you watch it? Did you watch it in our country? Yes, uh, I watch in my country. My country, okay. Do you uh, prefer watching movie alone or with friends? Uh, I always prefer uh, watching movie with friends. Sometimes uh, with parents, but uh, uh, watching movie with friends is more enjoyable. So. Okay. So, what kind of actually things you learn from watching movies? Uh, as I mentioned before, I love science fiction movie. So, science fiction movie. Uh, 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 science fiction uh, uh, from some science fiction movie will learn many uh, many in, uh, we learn many things that were in our solar system okay. and uh, we learn another planet and so on so on okay thank you so much now candidate B uh, let us talk to you also in the same place where do you live <laughs> I live in So, how can I go there from the nearest airport? From the nearest airport, uh, you can go by bus, CNG, bike, whatever you choose. Candidate B, can you speak a bit louder so that I can hear you properly? Uh, what type of transports are available in your area? In my area, uh, every transport is available like bus, CNG, rickshaw, and also Okay, so which transport uh, you nowadays you see but you did not see in the past? Now I see like by uh, Pathan, it is uh, now available everywhere. 
before it was a little bit rare, but now I see most of the people are using bike. Okay, which uh, transport do you use often? I use bus most of the time because this is uh, easier and also the cost is a little bit uh, lesser than other transport. Okay, do you uh, sometimes go long distance traveling? Yes, I do. Most of the time I travel long distance. What are the places have you visited so far? Uh, I visited Chiragam, Silet. Okay, so which part of a journey do you enjoy most? Uh, I mostly I travel the hilly area, so I like the roads of hills, hilly roads. I prefer the most. Okay, thank you. So candidate A and candidate B, now you will have the chance to ask questions in each other. Okay, so I'm giving you a sheet, okay, a paper, and then so you can make some notes. I mean the questions you you, you may ask. This is for you, candidate B. So, candidate A, are you ready? Uh, yes, sir. Please ask questions. Let's start. Okay. Do you watch TV program often? Yes, I do often watch TV programs on my free time. What kind of TV program do you watch? I like to watch uh, like National Geography channels or uh, news channels most of the time. Do you watch program on TV or your cell phone? Uh, most of the time I watch programs on my cell phone because I be with my cell phone all the time. Okay, so are you done? Yes. Candidate B, are you ready to ask questions? Yes. Please start. Do you read, uh, do you often read newspapers? Yes, I often read newspaper. I tend to know uh, what's happening around me and, and, and all over the world. What kind of newspaper do you read? Uh, I uh, read a uh, different kind of newspaper uh, such as uh, Protomalo, uh, Juventor and uh, English newspaper Daily Star. Which part of newspaper do you read most? I uh, read uh, most of the time sports uh, chapter, sports part, uh, because I like I love sports. I want to know um, uh, when uh, when uh, World Cup, like cricket World Cup, football World World Cup will start. And uh, which sportsmen, which sportsmen are uh, uh, achieve uh, new historical record, uh, etc. Are you done? Yes. All right. I will collect your papers and pencil now. Thank you. So we are in part three now. Uh, you both will have a topic to talk about. Okay, to make a conversation. All right, so candidate A and candidate B, we are in part three, we are in the final part. Now you need to make a dialogue between yourselves. Your topic is mobile phone. Please talk about mobile phone and its advantages and disadvantages in detail, okay? So candidate A, please start the conversation. Okay. Hey, Danita, do you use mobile phone? Yes, most of the time I do use mobile phone. What about you, Papia? Yes, I'm also. How many times do you use mobile phone in a day? Most of the time, whenever I'm free, I do use mobile phone. What about you? Yes, I'm also, uh, I use uh, most of the time I, uh, mobile phone. Sometimes um, I'm getting bored using mobile phone. So what do you think? What is the disadvantage of using mobile phone? Mobile phone uh, has many advantage and disadvantage. Mobile phone um, uh, nowadays, mobile phone work uh, uh, me, work with me uh, as my assistant. Um, I uh, set my alarm uh, alarm when uh, so that uh, I wake up early in the morning and uh, I set remain reminder so that I don't uh, forget uh, work something that is important. And 
Uh, yes, mobile phone has uh, some disadvantages. Uh, use mobile phone uh, um, lots of time. Uh, some, uh, lots of time. Um, uh, I I sometimes I problem uh, have uh, I problem and. Uh, um, Yes. We use most of the time mobile phones and for our important time. Yes, yes. Um, um, what's the advantages uh, in mobile phone? Do you think mobile phone has advantages? Yes. Obviously, there are many advantages. As you say, the uh, mobile phone is now our assistant. So we can say that our, whenever we need, we can use it. We can call our parents whenever we want. We can even if it is important, that, uh, it is the most fastest way to reach uh, someone. So yes, it is very much important. It, it has many more advantages. Do you think uh, uh, children, today's children use mobile phone uh, most of the time? It's uh, good for uh, uh, them? Obviously, uh, access is not good. Uh, everything has a limit, so children are uh, not usually permitted to use mobile phones. It uh, has some certain age, after that they should be provided uh, mobile phones. So I think mobile phone for children is not Okay, okay, thank you so much. Uh, we are done. Thank you. I will collect your paper and fix it. Thank you so much uh, for attending the IELTS Life Skills A1 speaking test today. So, candidate A, uh, Ms. Papia Shorkar, and candidate B, Talita Lewis. It was nice talking to you both. And after uh, I've been mean, observing the speaking test, uh, as an examiner, I can confirm that you both have passed the test. You have the ability make conversation to answer questions in different situations so this is really great talking to you once again thank you so much for thank your you time. sir Bye -bye. take care